What's good YouTube, by popular demand, here's a video on the BlackBerry 10 Android runtime environment and how to get Google Play services on your BlackBerry 10 device. There's still a thriving community of BlackBerry users that are holding on to their devices until its very last legs. And a lot of people in this community, or people that have always been curious about Blackberries, are trying to get some of their favorite Android apps onto their BlackBerry 10 devices. What you may or may not know is that there's actually an active Android runtime environment of Android 4.3 running on the BlackBerry 10 operating system. So what this means is that there's a lot of apps that you may use regularly on Android that might actually work on your BlackBerry 10 device. This is great news for a lot of users who are insistent on using their QWERTY keyboard handsets. So, in order to use a lot of the Android apps that you're looking for, you're going to need to be able to run Google Play services. And to do this, you're going to need to install a specially modified version of the Google Play services packages that has been designed to work for the BlackBerry 10 devices. Shout out to Cobalt for creating this version of Google Play services. You'll find a link for the package in the description below, so simply download them onto your computer or directly from your BlackBerry and make sure they're in your downloads folder. So once you have the files on your BlackBerry, open them up in your file manager and you'll see the individual APKs that you'll need to install. The first one we'll be installing is Cobalt's mobile network, so click on that one and install it. Once that's done, you'll need to install the Google Account app, so go back to the File Manager and install the Google Account APK. Accounts installed, you'll need to install the Google Play Store app, so head over to the Google Vending APK and install that APK. Once that's done, we can install the Google Games APK just in case you're planning on playing any game from the Google Play Store on your BlackBerry. Next, you'll want to install the Google Plus Whitelist APK. And then after that, you'll want to install the Google Settings APK.
The next step is a fairly important one, which is your BlackBerry Google ID. This will link up your BlackBerry to your Google account. Once you have this APK installed, you'll want to open it up as you can start to log in your BlackBerry ID as well as your Google account as well. So install the BlackBerry Google ID APK and open it up from your home screen. Here you'll get prompted to register this device and also to input your Google account into the BlackBerry. If you have an existing one, simply place your email and password into the fields and you should be able to move forward. I'll just punch my Google ID into the BlackBerry here. Get to the sign in screen, which may take a few moments. Hit next through the few next few menus here to continue the BlackBerry Google ID link up. From here, you can fire up the Google Play Store from your home screen. You might get this white screen or it may crash a few times or it may tell you that you require Google Play services to continue. Just keep pushing through or hit cancel or reset your BlackBerry a few times and the Google Play Store should load up eventually at this point once you've installed all the APKs. So there you have it folks, working Google Play services and a Google Play Store on BlackBerry 10 devices. If you like this video, leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.